The acclaimed British director said Glazer had understood the possible consequences, which made him braver still. Veteran. British director Ken Loach has added his support to Jonathan Glazer over the latter's controversial Oscar acceptance speech for the zone of interest. In interview with Variety, Loach said he had great respect for Glazer and that his speech was very brave. He added, and I'm sure he understood the possible consequences, which makes him braver still. So I've got great respect for him and his work. Glazer's speech in which he said he refuted his Jewishness and the Holocaust being hijacked by an occupation which has led to conflict for so many innocent people. Attracted condemnation and praise from all sides of the debate over the Gaza War. The Holocaust Survivors Foundation USA attacked Glazer's speech as morally indefensible. Hundreds of Jewish creative industry figures signed an open letter claiming he was fueling a growing anti-Jewish hatred around the world. And Son of Saul director Ellis Onem said, he should have stayed silent. On the other hand, Glazer was supported by the likes of Piotr Siewiski, director of the Auschwitz Memorial, who said Jonathan Glazer issued a universal moral warning against dehumanization, playwright Tony Kushner, and Jewish voice for peace Dot Loach, added that Glazer got lots of support from many, Many Jewish people who said it breaks the stereotype that all Jewish people support what Israel is doing. Because clearly that's not the case. The speech was hugely valuable in that it shows that diversity. So I've got great respect for what he did. Loach made his own protests on the Gaza conflict at the BAFTA Film Awards in February, raising his fist as screenwriter Paul Laverty held up a Stop the Massacre poster. The... Director also revealed he had tried but not succeeded in getting a project about the Middle East off the ground, saying, That was a subject that I would have liked to have worked on, but I didn't know quite how to tackle it. It would have had to be a documentary, but it was a big project and certainly beyond me for the last decade.